Welcome everyone in this video we're going to see what it's like to open a fresh coconut. Welcome everyone if you're new to the channel my name is Mark this is the Average Me channel and I recently moved to Florida and I'm really interested in seeing what it's like to open a fresh coconut. Not store bought this is from a tree in my neighborhood and listen you hear that? A lot of liquid in here I don't know what to expect but we're gonna open it up we're gonna start by cutting this with a Dremel tool then I'll probably take a chisel or a screwdriver or something and pop it open then we'll get to the nut inside the nut inside I think maybe the nuts the one holding the coconut that day didn't go as planned at all for starters my Dremel tool broke well a tool didn't break but the blade did so I had to try to do this with a hacksaw. So let's see how that turned out. Let's see how we do this. Okay, at this point, I realize a hacksaw isn't going to work very well. A regular wood saw would have worked much better, but I didn't have one. So I decided to split it open using a hammer and a screwdriver. <laughs> Wait a minute, did you see all that water pouring out? Once I saw that, I decided we had to salvage as much of the coconut water as we could. There was a nut forming inside, but not enough to get much meat from. The good news is, at this stage, the water is still really good to drink. It was really tasty, really sweet. So let's take a look at our next attempt. Go free We're going to document huh? this. It's empty. It's empty. It's hollow, completely hollow. All right but that's the start of a nut for sure. And attempt three was just plain ugly. It looks like stuff got inside there, cracked open and it started to rot. We finally reached the last one. Yep, might as well. Yes, please. Lose water. Yeah, I can see some in there. There is some in there. That's that same type of thing where it really doesn't have a, a nut form yeah, yet. Yeah, so these must be early, underdeveloped. Well, I found out a little bit about coconuts. First of all, you have to wait for them to fall from the tree unless you have a cherry picker or know how to climb a palm tree like the islanders. Uh, other than that, you wait for them to fall. The green ones are not quite ripe. However, the water inside is still really, really good. In fact, you can even eat the meat if you want to. There just isn't a whole lot of it. So from now on, it's the brown coconuts that I have to keep my eyes open for. By the way, did you know that falling coconuts kill about 150 people a year? Be careful around those palm trees. Well, that was a bit of an adventure. At least I learned something. I know how to crack open the coconuts after a lot of trial and error. I know to keep my eyes open for the brown coconuts. And in a future video, what I'm going to try to do is make a cocktail, make a coconut cocktail, right in the coconut itself. That ought to be a lot of fun. Well, I want to thank you for joining me today. As always, I encourage you to like and share the videos. Leave your comments down below. If you haven't already, please subscribe by clicking my face in the corner. And don't forget to ring that bell icon. That way you'll know when I post new videos. Thanks again for joining me. I'm Mark, and this is the Average Me Channel. Mm -hmm.